Yeah, Denelson looked like a Lamette, like Syndergaard or Wheeler or Harvey in their prime for the New York ball club. He was terrific, as good as advertised. Uh, another outstanding start for him. He just handcuffed the Braves tonight with that fastball slider combination. Denelson was the man, was <laughs> what he was tonight, and uh, completely controlled this ball game from the get-go. Uh, we showed a graphic that showed that his first three innings, sometimes he was a little shaky getting started, but uh, not tonight. He got off to a good start and worked from there, and uh, very impressive. So that uh, streak of winning series is over. On to Oakland, try to win one there. Yeah, hopefully uh, Jaime Garcia can figure things out. That's three bad ones in a row for him. Six runs in each of his last three starts. Mike Fultonevich gets the ball for the Braves uh, in uh, game one tomorrow. Sonny Gray will be the opponent for the Oakland A's. Mike, uh, as you know, has great strikeout stuff. Pitch counts have gotten him, though, in his last couple of outings. Well, and like Jaime, he's had a week off. He's had uh, an extra day or two of, work, of, of time to rest. That may work to his favor. But as we've seen sometimes with Mike, too much rest is not good because he's overthrowing. I hope that's not the case. We'll hope that uh, he can get this thing stopped and uh, at just a two-game losing streak, uh, for, for right. crying out loud, it's not all that bad. But uh, hopefully the long rest for him is not a, a deterrent. And Sonny Gray, one of the uh, very popular names that might be on the block for the Oakland A's, a guy that uh, is going to earn a lot of interest from major league teams looking for pitching at the trading deadline. So should be a fun matchup. Power versus power. Braves and the Oakland Athletics. That's a rare series. Can't wait to get to Oakland and get things started tomorrow night and hopefully get a winning streak started again for the Braves. So Kelsey and Brian, back to you in Atlanta. We'll see you tomorrow night.